Just a few Sabres took to the ice on Tuesday on what was an off-ice workout day for the group. The mental exercise of trying to rebound again, undoubtedly the hardest part for most right now. It's frustrating, you know, I think we, we were a better team most part of the game. We had more chances and, you know, it hurts even more when you lose a game like that. It's a little just mental mistakes and, and part of part of maturing, part of, of growing as a team. And look, nobody's a perfect player. I mean, it's everybody's going to make mistakes and it's, um, you know, covering up for a guy. If somebody gets beat, you know, it's the next guy being being in good position and helping a teammate out. It's it's, you know, that kind of thing that we're just we're just lacking a little bit right now. Um, just the situational awareness defensively, I think. I don't think there's an issue with the system. I think that we just have to execute as players. Yeah, I mean, it makes you mentally tougher when things are not going the easiest way. And, you know, there's no quitting. It's just working hard every day, trying to get better. It's time to keep moving forward. And, and because if you're, you know, if you're not moving forward, you're staying stagnant. We don't want that. Our focus is, is, is the next game. I think it's been like that. Uh, all season, but it's, it's particularly the last couple months, and um, it's going to continue to be that way. Two on the road await the group this week. They'll be into Chicago on Thursday, off to Denver to take on the Avalanche on Saturday. Sabres will depart for the Windy City after practice on Wednesday.